What's up everybody? So today I'm going to show you how to remove your valve stem, seal, and springs. I'm going to be using this tool right here. I got this off of Amazon. I'll leave a link in the description below. So all you're going to need is this tool, this thing too. It comes with a tool. And you're going to need a magnet. So now let's put this onto the head. So all you do is use your holes right here these ones right here set this on use these two that comes with the kit these two uh, bolts screw it in and this is a B16 head so then you take a half inch socket tighten these make sure they're nice and snug take this bolt right here screw it in right here so then you take this and you sit it down right here screw this down a little bit then you just take this up Screw it down. There you go. Take a 9 16 and tighten this down. And you just tighten. Take a magnet and get your uh, keepers out. So sometimes your keepers down there don't want to pop loose. So I just take a little flathead take it out sit it right here on somewhere to the side do the other one got that set it to the side somewhere then you take your 9 16 reverse this off your half inch pop this off Take this off. There's a valve spring. So I'm going to continue going down this, this side, and come back up this side. And then I'm going to show you how to take out the valve stem seal after I do that. And then all you do is get the little valve out. It's just push it from the top, pull it out from the bottom. And this is the exhaust side. And these ain't looking too good. A little gummed up. That don't look too bad. So in this one we got the valves out and the springs. And all these got the springs out. Now we gotta get the valve seal out. Which is that right there with the little black uh, rubber. See this one's already out and this one's not. See the one on the left is out. And the one on the right is still on. And the valve seal looks like this. That's what you're pulling out. And I'm going to show you how to do that. So this is your valve seal right here. And this is what you gotta pull out. And the way to do that is you're gonna use some pliers like this, or you can use some spark plug pliers. I mean, I couldn't get these to work, so I did. I used this. And pretty much what you do is, this is the top. You wanna be kind of careful when you do this too. You don't wanna mess anything up. You just grab it right on the edge, and kind of wiggle it, and pull. Sorry for the lighting, the lighting's not the best. There it comes. They're a pain in the ass to do it this way, but it works. You kind of tear up the seal 
but it works. So just be careful and take your time. There you go. This one came out the fastest so far. Up oh, there you go. This one actually came out with the little rubber seal thing right here on top. The other ones I took this little black piece off and then grabbed this out. So this one actually came out in one. So that's what it looks like. So you'll have 16 of these to pull. So that's how it's going to look. I just did all of them. And here are the exhaust valves. There's one. There's one. And these are pretty bad. Here's all the springs. And here are the seals. So yeah. So that's how you take out the valves, valve springs, and valve seals of a B16 head. Pretty much all B series are the same. Um, just make sure this, well this one was already off the block. So if you have it on the block, it's a little bit trickier and a little bit different to do. It's easier, to me it's easier to do it this way. So I mean everybody has their different ways of doing it. This is how I do it. So I hope you like this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next one.